Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to replace the battery or upgrade the battery on the MX Master 2S. So as you can see, I've already taken apart, well, I've already taken out the battery to save time for the process. I've also removed all the screws. So here, this is the original battery that was inside the MX Master 2S. It's a 500 milliamp, 3.75 volt battery. Now, I'm replacing it with another one that is also 3.7 volts, but it's at 1200 milliamp hour. So in order to open up this mouse, you'll need two types of uh, screw head. You'll need a T5 port screw and a J1 Phillips screw. So for the T5, you just need it for these two screws right here. So once you remove the two screws on top, everything else is J1. So under these pads over here, top and bottom, for a total of four Phillips head screws under the pads. So once you have removed six screws, you're just going to just simply lift up on the top portion, but you have to be careful because there is a ribbon that connects the top half of the mouse with the bottom half. And if you just pull it straight up, you're going to damage the ribbon. So you're going to try to lift it up from the top and from the left. So like that. As you can see right here, that's a ribbon that connects the top half with the bottom half. So if you just pull it straight up, you're just going to rip that ribbon right off. So there's this white holder that you just flip up. So if you flip that up, the ribbon will just pop off. Now I said to lift it from the top and the right side because if you look at it, there are hooks over here on the bottom and on the left side. And on the top and on the right side, there's no hooks. So the hooks are positioned over here. So you want to push up from these two sides so that you don't damage the hooks. Now, for the battery, there is no pull tab or anything. It's just double-sided tape, so you will have to pry it off. And before you do that, you will want to pull off um, the connector, which is just right here that connects to the main board. And there is three Phillips head screws that holds the battery tray down because this new battery, it has bigger capacity so it is slightly bigger than the original battery so it doesn't fit inside the original hole so instead I'm just going to remove the tray and I'm going to use some double sided tape so there you go apply some double sided tape and I'm just going to tape it down like that and for the connector you just push this in so just to test to see if this battery is alive, so right now it's off, and if I turn it on, there should be LED lights that light green on the side over here. So there you go, it turns green, so I do know that this battery is alive and good. So to assemble, you just do the reverse, you just put this ribbon back in, close that down. Then obviously you're going to put your screws back into place. Um, Rescrew the six screws on the bottom, so two torque screws over here, and the two Phillips screws under the pads. And now it should work fine. As you can see, battery turns on. And if I plug in the same charging cable, it should charge just fine. As you can see, if I plug it in, it's charged. So yeah. That's how you replace or upgrade a battery on the MX Master 2S.